All right, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, man. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content, and let's get right into it. But first off, I got to put a call out to all of my gym stars. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BKA the People's Champ, coming to you live with another video, man. Hey, look here, man. A lot to talk about, a little bit of time to talk about it in, man. But first off, let me ask y'all a question, man. Let me ask y'all a question. I made this joint for my wife. If I put something like this up in the store and change the football and, you know, the little logos and stuff. So, look, check it out. She, she's a Steelers fan, so we made Baby Yoda with the Steelers. That joint. Bye! Boy, hey, I'm telling you, that thing, that thing ain't ready, man. It's ready. So, you know, I just wanted to ask y'all that, man. If I put that up in the store, I, I can do, I can change the football and do all the different teams and all that stuff. Shaq working on it right now. Um, and we gonna get that squared away. But look here, man, that ain't what I'm here to talk about. Yesterday was the Christmas season, and I told my wife, Christmas, especially if you got a little boy, let me know if you got a little boy down in the comments and tell me if I'm right. Uh, she thought that I was tripping, but I told her that little boys are here to be our wrestling partners. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Like, like, like that, that's what they're here for. They're here, to, they're here for us to do wrestling moves on them and for us to get things for Christmas that we really want, but uh, we just gonna act like it's like it's for them. Such as so. You know what I'm talking about? Hey man, this thing right here, this thing right here, I don't know if y'all can hear that motor. This thing got a motor and you can rapid fire, pow, 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 pow. This thing, boy, it got the rails on it and everything. Boy, look at that thing, boy. Woo, <laughs> Hey look, it's got a clip. It got a clippy hole, 10 of them things, bye. Woo! So which one would you rather have? The Nerf scar? That's the segue. Or would you rather have the Nerf pistol? Now the pistol, it's got a silencer on it. You literally can put the silencer on the pistol and twist it. And then when you shoot it, you cock it back. You know, you put your, you put your next dart in there, but you cock it back, put it forward, and then you be like, huh? Hmm, 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 hmm. Yeah, that's what I thought, partner. Hey, that's what we're here for. That's what our little boys are for, man. Our excuse for us to continue to be boys because as I tell my wife all the time, men are just little boys with money. That's it. <laughs> it ain't nothing else to it. Anyway, speaking of gifts, man, I need to know how many of y'all got shafted yesterday. My boy sent me this joint, man. He said... I got the gingerbread man, the gingerbread backpack, and that thing so fresh on your back, shouting. Wait a minute. You got that cheesy ass stretch playmaker, my boy. Hey, hey, let me get a video in here, my boy. Hit me up, man, Lil Hulk, so we can so we can run this joint together, man. I wanna see how it's gonna look with a stretch playmaker and my guy. You know what I'm saying? Us playing together, man. So, you know, that, that's what's happening. All right, so first news story of the day, man. Y'all know Gold West was yesterday. Y'all know people were boosting. Uh, we, we definitely going to change the uh, studio up one day. We got a new studio coming up. But right now, this is what we got. Um, Gold Rush was yesterday. People were boosting. And one of my constituents out there, he uh he was able to... Uh, obviously, it was Big Boy IQ, man. Come on. Uh, that, was, that was Big Boy IQ right there with the backpack. But uh, one of my constituents, one of my... Uh, one of my Tracy, what we call him, Tracy the coldest, Tracy Luther the coldest is, that I got out there. Um, he, he let me know some. If y'all if y'all got that joke, y'all let me know. He said that people are dead seriously out here boosting in Gold Rush. That's not what's, what's funny. The thing is people are boosting in Gold Rush and then he said they're changing their name back once they're done. So obviously he got his language Korean and all that stuff, but it says name will be changed back. The camera was kind of shaky, I don't know why. Game will be changed back after boosting. I guess it was gonna say, uh, it must all be moving. So it's gonna say after boosting the Gold Rush event, but people are literally doing this, changing their names, and then changing it back and putting it in the doggone thing. It literally says name will be changed back after. I, bro, I, I I don't I don't know, man. Look. Let me tell you why that's stupid. In the background, your name is attached to a number. It's called a unique identifier, right? This unique identifier is unique to you, because that's what unique means, right? 
this unique identifier is unique to you. No matter what you do, you cannot change that unique identifier. This is how Feed Your Kids got banned. He changed his name a ton of times, but in the end, his unique identifier is the same. And thus, they knew who to ban. So this won't work. Maybe it'll keep people from quote unquote reporting you or something like that, but if they report your name, it reports your unique identifier that's behind the scene. It's just like a website can change its name, but in the background, that website has an IP address. Unless you change the IP address, people can always get to the website. You understand what I'm saying? If they, if they know what the website is. So like if I try to get the Google DNS, they may change their DNS name, right? But I can always get there if I type in 8.8.8.8. .8 .8 .8. That's all I'm saying. So just be mindful of that, man. That stuff right there, it doesn't work. I can't believe that people are still boosting in Gold Rush, though, like Boost Rush. As my homeboy T. Miller say Boost Rush. Like, it's just crazy because people will go in there, win Gold Rush, claim they didn't boost, and claim that they're the only people that won without boosting when everybody else was boosting, my guy. Like, it, it don't work like that. But, hey, it is what it is. Hey, Godspeed to you. If that's what you feel like you got to do to get to get uh to get your money up, do your thing. Hey, next up, Steezo the God is back, and he's in the lab, and he said, I'm out here. I'm out here. The number one most influential person of NBA 2K19. Don't at me. Why? Because he forced them to put us in this dribble system that we're in today. It is what it is. Who else did it? Everybody else was just a clone or a copy of Steezo. That, 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 you know, they just did, so they might have done moves, but they just did a variation of the moves that he was doing. And that's really, that's how I feel about it. Some people came up with their own unique moves and stuff like that. But he's just letting you know that he's in the lab. He's breaking the game. He's doing, uh, you know, he's doing some stuff, man. Let me tell you what, though. I mean, isolation is back, though. Like, if you have a shooting center like I got, isolation is back, man. Like, people are, people are really isolating out here. Ain't nobody really running screens and stuff like that anymore i feel like to be honest i feel like this right here when people are isoing i feel like this is more difficult to guard than the back and forth up top behind the screens i feel like the screens part is easy because in either situation we're gonna force you to shoot twos but it's just crazy because with isolation you always run the risk you have a much higher risk of getting your ankles broken by um, uh, you getting your ankles broken by by tight handles. You get your ankle broken by tight handles, he's gonna sprint to the side. He's gonna get a three. But if if you're playing if you're playing the the behind the back screens and all that stuff, if you get if you're forcing him this way, let's say you're forcing him to the corner where your guy got help. If he gets to that hash, the guy comes down. The other guy switches. Now he can't take the shot. If he gets to the other hash, the center pulls up. Nine times out of ten, if you got a center like me, you're not going to be able But when you're on this island by yourself in isolation and you get tight handled like that, and then you you stuck over here and your ankle get broken, I mean, there's nothing you can really do about it. So I fear isolation more than I fear the screens and behind the backs and stuff like that. We were having a conversation last night about the NBA 2K. Uh, one, of, one of the guys in the chat was saying, you know, they wanted to bring back 2K19 dribbling. I said, bro, could you imagine 2K19 dribbling in this game with the escape dribble, with the hop step, with all the things that we got, with no paint defense, because nobody has any interior defense. Every guard took the bait and didn't put on interior defense and stuff, bro, you wouldn't be able to stop anybody. It'll be fun until they did it to you, and then it wouldn't be fun anymore. So, you know, you wouldn't be able to guard nobody. We couldn't bring back 2K19 dribbling, and I'm glad that not everybody is able to dribble like this. But I'm just letting you know, Young Steez is back, man. He back doing his thing, man, so you can't, uh, I can't, I can't deny it, man. Hey, you can't hold a good dog now. Uh, number, no, the next thing we got up, man. Hey, your boy C boy Freezy said he got the best jump shot in the Giz name right now. So, look here, check it out. In the corner, pull up, drink, and he shoot with the meter on. Look here, y'all see, y'all see the name, man. Y'all see it, C boy, C boy Freezy, been appealing to in the community for a long little while. All that good stuff, man. So, yo, yo, go check out that video. Uh, like the video up. And, you know, let him know what's happening. Uh, link will be down in the description. Will link be down in the description? Well, y'all know who C-Boy is, man. It's just C-B-O-Y, man. Let's search that on, on here and you're going to find it. And uh, you'll be good to go. Also, man, they got a new VC glitch, but it's the old VC glitch, man. Like, it's so stupid, bro. Look, look here. Y'all see who it is? 
you might want to go by here and check it out but i'm telling you do not go by here and check it out if you go by here and check it out and look at it whatever uh check out the video but this glitch has been around since nba 2k 18 and before you go to any up you lag out of the game you do all this stuff man look here man i'm gonna tell you like this i'm gonna tell you this and i'm gonna tell you good if you do that glitch you will get banned if you do that glitch you will get banned i'm telling you 100 percent without equivocation we saw so many people in 18 get banned that day that they had high rollers. We saw so many people in 19 get banned at the beginning of the year. We seen so many people in 20 get banned this year for that. Do not do it, but if you do it, do it at your own risk. I'm telling you 100 times out of 100. If you do it, you're going to get banned. If you keep doing it, they can. that's way too easy to track that you keep disconnecting at the point of the game starting. You're going to get banned. Don't do it. I'm trying to tell you, but it does work though. Because I mean, I, I don't understand why people don't um like uh, all the all the old stuff in the game still works, man. So it is what it is. And now, uh, last but not least, hey, I had to show y'all this meme here real quick, man. They said this is Pat Beverly. This Pat Beverly after he uh this Pat Bev after he um after he there blocked LeBron's shot, boy. Give me my. <laughs> Hey, the bad part about it, I saw that and I said that looked just like Pat Bell, boy. Look at you, boy. Hey, if you grew up in the hood, though, if you grew up in the hood, you know that's true. It's always an older cat walking around with his shirt off. He probably, he may or may not be inebriated. But he can do all types of stuff like that, and he always bedding the kids and, and, and the, and the uh, boys on the block. You know what I'm talking about for something like that. And anything he say he can do, he can do it. Y'all, y'all, hey, y'all let me know. Uh, we used to have one cat here walk around and be like, he'll do it and be like, yeah, that's for you right there, boy. And then he'll get his money and go on and they would always rib him up to do stuff. But yo, it is what it is, man. Anyway, that's all I got for y'all this morning, man. Just hope y'all, you know, merry, merry, happy holidays to everybody because everybody don't do Christmas and all that good stuff. And y'all let me know if y'all want me to hook up one of these joints, one of these joints for y'all, man. Um, you know, if you got a team or something, you can DM me on uh, on social media, anything. It's crazy because it looks different right here, but then we got we got natural light, like the daylight sunshine bulbs, because you know we do YouTube and stuff, so we gotta have this ultra brights. So it's like right here, it looks so dark and rich, don't it? In the regular artificial light or in the regular sunlight, but in the in the super bright artificial light, what we have to do it to take all our pictures, it it, it looks like that. But it looks so good, man. That, that doggone hoodie is fine. Anyway, y'all let me know which one of y'all, which one of these would y'all have taken. And now I write, having little boys is just our excuse to be little boys again. That's it. Men are little boys with money. That's all we are. And when you get a son to compound that problem, <laughs> I'm buying him everything that I want, that I see. That's cool. And I'm, I'm going to buy it for him. And I'm going to act like it's for him. But then he hadn't played with those yet. So, hey, it is what it is. Anyway, I got to get up out of here, man. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm going to holler at y'all next time. Till next time. Hey, it's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ. Got speed. Also, like the video, man, and let me know what you got under the tree in, um, in 2K yesterday. All I got was them weak-ass joggers, man. So, hey, it is what it is. I'm going to holler at y'all. Peace.